in Tri-State. Up against, uh, you know, uh, I guess this is a reoccurring theme. So we have two players that we know and then two players that we're not familiar with. I'm not too familiar with these two players. Maybe you might be? Uh, no, actually. I'm unfamiliar. I, I know ADHD, but that's about it. I mean, it's going to be interesting to see the other the other players uh, making it this far. You know, you don't sleep on anyone. Exactly. <laughs> that's, my, that's my phrase. Smash 4, don't sleep. Nope. All right, so we're going to see if we have a... Oh, I, they're whispering to each other, so this is clearly going into the match. All right, so we have Average Joe and... K oh, Average Joe. All right, you know what? He's a Xanadu native. I just... um I don't recognize him without the the the, 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 the Gamer look, because he oh, usually doesn't have that. Yeah. He has a... Uh, okay. Yeah, he doesn't wear a hat, so he kind of threw me off there. But that's cool stuff. And we got Kenny. Uh, so I'm going to feel bad every time Kenny dies. Oh, my God. <laughs> No, I'm totally not going to say it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. All right, so right now, Fable is doing really... I'm not too sure about Fable's tag. I feel a certain type of way about that. Fable. K? Oh, uh, no. Uh, the in-game tag. Like, like maybe oh. if you were using Cloud or Rosalina, perhaps. But, but Yoshi? Yeah, Yoshi's just fine. So, oh, oh, my gosh. Spike. Where was that platform, though? The big, what dirty is... spike from DK. I'm pretty you... sure his downer went through that platform. And you know DK doesn't wash his feet, so that's a really dirty spike. Both bigger than he gave that man pink eye. Uh, oh, <laughs> Can we just... Uh, the little yeah. whack-a-mole into Gimp? Are you serious? Oh, my gosh. What's going on, though? <laughs> oh, no. And another Gimp. And he's out already. Seriously, a record. I think this was the fastest. <laughs> I I've think it's been somebody. a minute and 30 seconds, folks. Have you ever seen somebody lose all three of their stock this fast? <laughs> I don't think so. I think this is a record. I'm Dennis, are like, you watching? Like, holy crap. I'm only picturing DK with, like, Photoshopped arms of swords because that's just how I picture his limbs as swords. <laughs> Seriously, his limbs cover, like, half the damn stage. It's insane. So right now, they're going to have to focus and make sure that they're listening to each other and playing off of each other. That's the only way to make it out of this mess. Uh-oh, but you're going off stage, but of course the down B to cover that. Going off back here, ADHD trying to go for the up to up air. All right. Oh, Kenny dying, unfortunately. But right now, Average Joe's not looking so average. He's actually looking pretty exceptional with his stock tanking ability. Staying alive right now. Uh oh, Kenny holding down the stage. Still staying alive, Average Joe. Very nice stuff. Good back air there from Average Joe, trying to get back on stage. He really needed to regain that space. Seriously, at 128. Oh, wow. wow. That was really fast reaction. Average Joe makes a clap and a very silent death. Average right. Joe. Oh, what? Right. Give this man some water. Seriously. <laughs> a water and a trophy, because that was pretty amazing. That was pretty amazing play. Oh, uh, uh, ADC smiling it off. He's not. Usually when you see a kind of loss like that, both players usually have a pretty somber expression. And like, man, what just happened? Exactly. Oh, the and, fastest uh, doubles match I think we've casted. <laughs> yeah, but I think the reason why White's staying cool is that he knows that's an exceptional match. That's not going to happen again the way he sees it. So I think they're going to come, uh, come back a lot stronger here. I'm just picturing Average Joe right now walking up to ADC and straight up... Son, not today. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> seriously. This is literally a battle of, uh, of DK and Diddy. Great oh. option to recover that high, trying to avoid ADHD's back airs. Diddy Kong's back airs obviously be very good. And I love the fact that uh, Fable is kind of like playing true to, to Yoshi's style, which is being really good at staying in the air. Just jumping, throwing eggs. Taking advantage of your hitboxes. Yeah, and get aerial Lingering speed. hitboxes at that. Yeah, for those of you who might not... Oh, Jesus. That, Wyatt, watch I'm yourself. I'm really surprised I actually hit Fable. Yeah, it's funny because when someone gets hit, the hitbox pauses. And other people can get hit when they jump into it. So. All right, so what I like seeing right now is uh, Average Joe's follow-up game. It looks like that's where he, right there, yes. right there. It looks like that's where he excels at the most, is following up after hits. So I really like this group synergy that I'm seeing from Kenny and Joe. I just hope that they have a, a conscious decision to actually like feed that, you know what I mean? Like sometimes people do cool team stuff and they don't know that they're doing it. So hopefully they catch on to it and see that it works. Oh no, on the side beat. That is the problem with, with holding shield on a platform against Diddy. He's just command gonna, grabs. Command grab. It's, it's just gonna rip you right off. Uh, so right now, Fable is Good the one sight. holding on to stocks right now, and the up tilt's gonna take it. Yes. 
Watch out. Watch out for the spike. You definitely don't want to be off stage against uh, Yoshi. That's one of the worst spots to be in. Oh, off stage, definitely. Wow. Kenny just letting forth with these uh, Pikachu combos. Jab, jab. Nice team combos from Fable and Kenny. I mean, I'm sorry. Kenny and Average Joe. Uh, B super armor, not quite. <gasps> nice. As you were mentioning oh, earlier. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Joe, what are you doing? ADHD and Fable were looking like another uh, uh, upset, 2-0 um, upset here if they don't shape up their act. You were mentioning how it's easy to react to Pikachu's grabs to follow up, and that's exactly what Average Joe did with that up smash. Yeah, and that's what I, exactly what I mean by rolls. You gotta know who's gonna be the one setting up and who's gonna be the one spiking the ball. Good it's stuff just, there. This wow. position right now, DK with rage. Yeah. It, uh, oof. One more. Careful there, Fable. I mean, As you mentioned, Fable really uh, taking advantage of his air mobility with oh. his lingering hitboxes. Good stuff. But he's still got a lot of homework left to do. Uh, yeah, Pikachu was in high percent. That might have been an issue, but... Uh, that was a great egg throw, too. That was to cover uh, in case Pikachu did get out of egg. He knew that P he wasn't able to get Pikachu into uh, low percent. Yeah, that's good clutch decision-making. It's really hard to make the toughest decisions when you only have, like, five or ten frames to decide what uh -huh. to do. Uh-oh, careful there. Back air is going to send him right back out. Oh, this no. This spacing, though, oh, unfortunate. It, it was really difficult to get past the, the team spacing that uh, Kenny and Average Joe were doing because Average Joe was in the perfect area where just in case if uh, Yoshi was to roll onto the stage, yeah, Average Joe got him. If you neutral get up, Pikachu got you. Your only option, you're going to have to jump. But Yeah, like that's not really going to get too much, honestly. Yeah. So that's, that's really good, good stuff, stuff there. Really good stuff. So so far, we're seeing a lot of uh, a lot of um, upsetting play. Not literally like upsetting us. No, or no, else. like like this is great play. Yeah, upsetting as in this is so good. <laughs> yeah, like everyone's just getting upset because you would look at a, a former brawl legend like ADHD and uh, someone who's you know consistently placing high in his locals, uh, fabled. Uh, I've I've never heard of Kenny personally. So again, it's like I said, when you get players that you know, come out of nowhere and, and surprise you. That's my favorite part about majors is, is seeing that happen. And we're, I'm getting a lot of exactly what I want today here. So that's good stuff.